Hey, this is Dave. How y'all doing? Uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to make a series of videos and show you how to set up the Infinity uh, trading platform, or what you call the DOM, D-O-M, Depth of Market. When you open your uh, Infinity AT platform, this is what you're going to see. The first thing you want to do is set your default quantity right here. Uh, grab this bar and move it over if you don't see it just grab this bar drag it all the way to the end till you see default quantity now when you first start this will be a zero all you do you just highlight it uh, okay see the zero all I'm gonna do is, is just go in there and I'm gonna type in three now I have a default quantity of three so we've got that set now what that does that transfers over here and when I place my orders I'm automatically going to get a quantity of three contracts so we set that to three you can set that to any number you want to we'll minimize this now I'm going to show you in in this video how to set up multi bracket orders what a multi-bracket order is, is when you're trading multiple contracts, when you place your order, it will set your stop loss and it will set your exits all in one execution. And I want you to do it that way because I want you to make sure you get that stop loss in there, okay? Alright, now, what you're looking at here in the background is a uh, chart of the uh, live chart of the ES we've got a target up here of 1095 and a 50% uh, support area at 1084 so just keep an eye uh, if you want to on this candle you'll see it moving um, and I wanted to do this live so hopefully I can get a couple uh, trades to work out and show you how things work okay first thing you want to do click on this little button right here that says P that's going to open this little window go to the set multiple exits tab and click that okay let's set up group A and group A has three uh, options for the lot size so this will be let, let's use this for an example we're trading three contracts and we want our first contract to come off at a certain area so we're going to enter one that's for one contract our second exit will be one contract and then the lot size for our third exit will be one contract now where do we want them to come off at we want to take the first one off at plus one point so we go here to where it says profit target number one and enter this in ticks so we know that one point is four ticks so we go one two three four now what that means is one contract will come off when we have four ticks of profit alright let's say we want to take the next contract off at a point and a half so we're going to put put in a six that's a point and a half now the third one we want a runner which means you know if you get a good run you want to let it go so we're going to just put this way up here let's say like uh five points so we'll set that for 20 ticks okay first contract comes off at one point second contract comes off at one and a half points third contract comes off at five points but we'll probably uh, will move that and as you, I want you to watch this candle we're getting a sell off here uh, it's 336 so we're selling off a little bit towards the end of the day this is group A you see I got it checked here click OK now I'm going to try to jump in here and get a trade while this market is dropping uh, I want you to check quick click I want you to check auto I want you to go down here select multi bracket now we gotta set our stop loss 
our stop loss we're going to set to four points so that's 16 ticks everything in here is done by tick okay three contracts right here multi bracket stop loss 16 that's four points this market is selling off I wonder I've got 1084 75 actually 1085 as a support area so here's what we're going to do the left side is the buy side okay the right side is the sell side if you're going long you click over here if you're going short you click over here up here you have four buttons buy market sell market join be a join offer don't use the buy market and sell market because when you do that you place an order at the market and you can get filled anywhere and you're probably going to get one or two ticks of slippage placing a limit order you just click let's say we want to go in here and just remember now I'm using this for example so if, if we get something wrong it's fine I just want to show you how this dome works let's place an order at 1085 so all we got to do is click one time right there at 1085 now look what's happened you see three that means we got three contracts waiting to be filled at 1085 now if this doesn't get filled in just a minute I'm gonna move it because I want to show you what happens when you get a fill. so we're already up to 1087 here's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna manually take this order I'm gonna cancel it this will give me a chance to show you a, another function that's cancel all if you hit cancel all see it's gone it's blank it's empty there's no orders that's a quick way to get out all right now just for this demonstration I'm going to hit uh, just about where price is so we'll get filled so let's say we want to go long at 1086 and three quarters okay I'm filled now look what just happened look look at all these other numbers and green and red what this did it filled me long see right here plus three so that tells me I'm long 1086 and three quarters and remember back here in properties where we set uh, our first exit at plus one so at 1087 and three quarters we've got one contract coming off remember we set our second contract at a point and a half so six ticks from our entry we've got the second contract coming off and then if we were fortunate enough that it ran you know we would take our third one off now this down here the red line that's your stop if price moves down to this stop we're gonna get taken out and that's fine that's not the point this this is not a live trade uh, I didn't really analyze this trade I just wanted to set this dome up so you could watch it at work now uh, let's see I'm gonna have to make it do something because price is gonna start bouncing around I really wish it would just move up real quick 